Hey, Graffiti King here, and can you believe that I drew this logo in just 30 seconds? I had an idea for it and just went on the internet and found a drawing program. There were actually at least three that I saw in the search results, so I'm sure there's even a couple more that I didn't even investigate. I found one that I liked, and I fiddled around with it, and produce something that looked like the graffiti king that I wanted to draw. And it's good, and I like it. Is it perfect? No. Could I go and find someone and obsess over it for months? Sure I could. And many people do obsess over small things that don't deliver the big result. Give you another example. Just a few moments ago, I was excited and I recorded a message on a software program using my laptop. And then I realized that I didn't have the microphone plugged in. So I had to use the on board or built in microphone on the laptop. And the sound was a little different. I listened to it, I fiddled with the, uh, what's the word? Um, volume, and I adjusted the audio quality to get it up to the level that's required, and I just hit send. I just published it. Why? Because I'm in the business of doing the thing that I want to do. Same thing with the logo, and I urge you that if you want to be in the business of doing whatever it is you want to do, do it. You may take more than 30 seconds to draw a logo, or if you record something and don't quite get the result you want, you can re-record it. But when you do either thing or another thing, do it. Get out there and do it. There are many wise people in history who have uttered the phrase, don't try. And that means... Quit obsessing over things that don't give you the result that you actually want. Go and get the result that you actually want. And you do that by doing it. Even if it's a little imperfect, even if it's a first attempt or rough draft, do it. Okay? And you will be much happier. The anxiety that crowds the procrastinating mind is produced by the procrastination it's not produced by the thing you're trying to do. It's being produced by the thoughts you have about the thing you're trying to do. And that's a paraphrase of another famous philosopher. And it's all just common sense. Go and do the thing that you want to do. Get the result that you want, and you can keep doing it. You can get better and more proficient and you will be doing the thing that you always said you wanted to do, and you will find that you are happier. And so I also urge you to click on the links under this message and investigate our books that are available to you right now on the Kindle Amazon store, and you can investigate our ideas about personal development and about business opportunity. That's all for now. Go and do the thing you want to do.